From lawnmowers to refrigerators, there are supply chain problems at companies all around the world, and it's making it nearly impossible to get your hands on anything for your home. And you can blame this on the pandemic. WBZ's Bill Shields shows us why. George Washington Toma has been around for years selling appliances and TVs, but never have they gone through a period like COVID. What's happened is there's shortages of everything. COVID has slammed the brakes on everything from steel and aluminum to electronic control boards. But we're seeing large back orders on things, especially dishwashers and refrigeration. One of the world's biggest manufacturers of compressors for refrigerators is in Brazil, and production has been drastically curtailed. Even factories here have been slowed by COVID. Men and women working shoulder to shoulder pre-COVID, they were able to produce literally twice the product that they can produce now. From refrigerators to cars and trucks, COVID has forced a slowdown. Even power equipment companies are struggling. Getting new components from overseas has been very difficult. So I, I think that slows the whole process down. At Morrison's Power Equipment in Plymouth, getting new lawn mowers or leaf blowers is no longer a matter of placing the order. And it's given rise to a jump in repairs. When you kind of got to decide, well, do I really want to fix this or should I just buy a new one? Um, but with the availability being so difficult, we may you know, have to look at putting some more money into machines that we traditionally would advise people not to repair. At least TV manufacturers seem to be in pretty good shape right now. But if there's anything else you want for around the house, furniture, refrigerator, and you want it in, let's say, a couple of months, better order it now. I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. Hmm.